This April, we will mark the day when the Jewish people answered that ancient question. Can a country be born in a day? Can a nation be born in a moment? 70 years ago, the United States was proud to be the first nation in the world to recognize the state of Israel. In 1995, Congress adopted the Jerusalem Embassy Act, urging the federal government to relocate the American Embassy to Jerusalem and to recognize that that city is Israel's capital. Our approach on Israel is tied together by one major idea, the simple concept that Israel must be treated like any other normal country. When the world recognizes that, then peace becomes possible. By finally recognizing Jerusalem as Israel's capital, the United States has chosen fact over fiction. We're not taking a position on any final status issues including the specific boundaries of the Israeli sovereignty in Jerusalem or the resolution of contested borders. This is nothing more or less than a recognition of reality. Let us rededicate ourselves to a path of mutual understanding and respect. We know that peace is possible if we put aside the pain and disagreements of the past. The winds of change can already be witnessed across the Middle East. Long-standing enemies are becoming partners. Old foes are finding new ground for cooperation. And the descendants of Isaac and Ishmael are coming together in common cause. We will work and strive for that brighter future where everyone who calls this ancient land their home shall sit under their vine and fig tree, and none shall make them afraid.